morning, mathematicians. It is time for 10 Frame Fun Thursday, our last number talk for the year. Today I'm going to be showing you some 10 frames again, and I want you to use all of those strategies and skills that you've learned this year to help you figure out how many dots you see. What do you do to see them quickly without trying to count them one at a time? Thank you for joining me this year for all of our fun number talks, and I hope you continue to use these strategies to help you in first grade next year. All right, let's go ahead and get started. Here's our first set of 10 frames. How many dots do you see? What strategy did you use to see them quickly? Turn and tell your grown up now. Here's what I did. I noticed there were five dots in the top 10 frame and five dots in the bottom 10 frame. I took the five in the bottom 10 frame and in my mind slid them up to the top 10 frame. That gave me 10 dots total. Did you figure out the number a different way? Next set of 10 frames. How many dots do you see? What strategy did you use to see them quickly? Tell your grown-up your answer now. I noticed the top 10 frame is full. The bottom 10 frame has 5. 10 and 5 more equal 15. I can think of it like 10s and 1s. One group of 10 and 5 lonely 1s is 15. Did you find your answer in a different way? Great job! Here's our third set of 10 frames. How many dots do you see? What strategy did you use to see them quickly? Turn and tell someone now. I am noticing a pattern. Are you? They added another full 10 frame. So now I have two groups of 10 and five dots in the bottom 10 frame. Two groups of 10 and five more equals 25. What did you do to find your answer? Image four, how many dots do you see? What strategy did you use to see them quickly? Explain your thinking to someone now. Here's what I did. The pattern changed slightly. There are still two groups of 10, but this time there are also two groups of five. In my mind, I took one of the groups of five and combined it with the other. Now I have three groups of 10 because I had two groups of 10 to start with and then combine my fives to make another 10. Three groups of 10 equals 30. How did you find your answer? Last one for today, mathematicians. How many dots do you see? What strategy did you use to see them quickly? Take a minute to explain your thinking. This time I'm going to count by tens and then add on my extra five ones. 10, 20, 30, then my five lonely ones. Three groups of 10 and five lonely ones equals 35. What did you do to find the answer this time? Here's that extra challenge for today. Go back and look at each picture of 10 frames. Write an addition equation or tell a grown-up an equation that matches each set of 10 frames. Good luck! Thanks for doing 10 Frame Fun Thursday with me today. And thanks for joining me for our math talks during our time of distance learning. I hope you had fun and I hope you learned a lot. Have a great summer!